Oh my gosh, Pepper Joe, something smells really good. What's cooking? What's cooking today, Penny, is my ham and bean soup. But to call it ham and bean soup doesn't do it justice. What it is, is it's a 15 bean soup, hot and spicy, a little bit of an Italian flair to the seasonings, and it's cooked with a ham bone from ham that we had left over from a couple nights ago. Let me give you a look. Here's that ham bone. Now, by the way, don't get hung up on that. You can buy a ham hock at the store. You can use ham flavoring. And even if you don't go in that direction, if you're a vegetarian, put a little bit of olive oil in the bean soup. But the important thing, and I say this in a lot of my recipes and a lot of my cooking videos, improvise. Make yourself happy. But what I want to stress today is crock pot cooking. I cooked this bean soup for about 10 hours in my crock pot. Me and Penny were at the beach. We exercised. We went shopping. Well, to tell you the truth, Penny went shopping. But anyway, we got all our household chores done. We paid the bills. We worked on the computer, blah, blah, blah. All the while, the 15 bean soup with ham chunks in it was cooking away. I love crock pot cooking. How do you know when the beans are done? I'll tell you my secret. It's when they're tender. <laughs> All right, here we go. You saw the ham hock. Now check out this bean soup. Nice and tender now, ready to go. Major ingredients, I'm going to show you in a minute anyway, but it's carrots and potatoes and celery and garlic and onions. And then a whole bunch of seasonings. Now, let me show you more about the ingredients for my 15 bean soup. Hey, what about those delicious and nutritious ingredients? Does that not make you wanna go make some 15 bean and ham soup a la Pepper Joe? Mm. Now, let me bring this video home. I'm going to show you how we serve this 15 bean soup. Okay, one thing I may not have mentioned is along with that ham bone, you can see the chunks of ham that are in there. I chopped up maybe about a, a fistful, this big, of leftover ham. Always make a ham, keep the bone, keep a little bit left over. It's so great with eggs and ham. And of course, I love it with soup, but let me serve this for you. Let me be your host and your chef and show you how we do it here at Pepper Joe's. This is how we roll. So you have your bean soup. I like to put in my black bean soup and my 15 bean soup, a dollop of fresh sour cream. I use the light brand. And also, always spices. Uh, this is my roasted help. I'm sorry, roasted cayenne peppers that have a nutty and roasted flavor. Sprinkle a little bit of them on there. Would you just please look at that delicious bean soup, ready to eat. So healthy, high protein, low calories, low fat, and so, so good for you. So there you have it, Penny. Any questions? Yeah, just one. Is that a salt and pepper beard I see? Yes, it is. And I need to be honest with you. I'll tell you why I have it. I have it because I do not drink very much beer. But when I do, it's a Dos Equis. And then I wash it down with many, many, many martini. <laughs> Salute. And visit pepperjoe.com and please check out our free newsletters, Penny's Tomatoes, Pepper Joe's. We will send you a free mail order catalog. We'll send out 50,000 free catalogs this year. I don't even want to tell you what that costs. And also join our Facebook page. We've got 46,000 fans and growing daily tips, daily cooking, daily pictures, daily free, well, not actually daily, but free stuff periodically, but daily fun. Join us at pepperjoe.com.